I also wanted to ask you about John Hadle and, and some of your memories of, of Hadle. I'm sure you have a million. Yeah, I, uh, uh, we got word this morning that, you know, we lost John this morning and, and uh, uh, I, 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 I don't want to speak for others. Dave has probably been around him even more than I have over time. But I don't know of anybody that was more uh, Jayhawk or loved Kansas more than John Hale. He gave himself as a, you know, he grew up in Lawrence, so you knew he loved KU growing up. Uh, he came here as a student athlete, you know, had unbelievable success, unbelievable pro career. And then as soon as he gets out of the pro career, he wants to come back and get back to the school as a, as a coach, as a, as a fundraiser, and has been tied to the athletic department, KU, Dave, if I'm not mistaken, since he retired from professional football, basically every year. In that, in that right? Yeah, he started out as a as a coach. Uh, even uh, early on, then he was a coordinator for Pam Brown. Yeah. Took us to a bowl game yeah. before he left. Yeah. yeah, amazing, amazing run. And 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 the thing about it is, uh, uh, the coolest dude that would never talk about how cool he was. Mm -hmm. He was cool because uh, uh, he, he, he never had to talk about himself or boast about himself and what he accomplished. I mean, the dude threw for like 40,000 yards in, 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 in you know, NFL, AFL, whatever it was. Uh, guys are getting in the Hall of Fame without stats like, like what he's got. And, and, uh, and, he, and, and he probably had more stories uh, about hanging out with uh, you know, Lance Rensel and, and, and Joe Namath and guys like that, that that anybody could ever have. Roman Gabriel and all those guys. Uh, uh, I mean, he was a big, big guy, big daddy. And and, uh, and then, uh, but he always made it about others. I, 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 I love that and he loved KU and, you know, he hasn't been, he hasn't been healthy for quite some time now. And he's had about the last five or six years, he, you know, he, he hasn't been able to, to uh, uh, have the same, uh, impact on us and others is as what what we're no we're, we're used to because you know a bad fall where he hurt himself and things like that but but uh yeah amazing guy he'll be missed and he's one like max there's there should be a, a memory of him uh uh not just for football but for everything going on with ku from this point forward